Hi, a warm welcome to all and uh, this is the new beginning. Again, we are going to start a new subject, getting started with competitive programming to get uh, the NPTEL certification. So now we are going to uh, see the assignment zero. Already for assignment zero, you can uh, get the answers also. But this is for the small beginning so that you can easily understand what actually we are going to do. And this consists of uh, practice assignments, assignment 0 and programming assignment, problem 1, problem 2 and problem 3. Here we are having three problems and we need to solve the pro problems in the coding. And for the practice assignment we are having this multiple answers. So let's see one by one. So coming to the assignment 0, here we are having uh, questions. So how many once does the following procedure print when run with input n. So I'm not going to explain all these things in assignment 0. From assignment 1, we'll, we'll discuss everything because uh, assignment 0 is uh, not considered for the final score. This is just for the understanding of the subject and uh, um, this is uh, for just reference purpose only. So for uh, uh, question number 1, we are, uh, we, we have the, we are having the options four options in that the option either B or C is the correct answer and for question number two the answer is three pairs and for question number three the answer is six seven six y and question number four we are having two options this is A answer and E options are the right answers and for the question number five none of the above question number six it is merge sort and for question number seven it is neither statement is the right answer and for the question number eight it may not always produce an accurate answer and for question number nine it is two and for question number ten it is impossible to turn off all squares and coming to the eleventh question answer is no and twelfth question the answer is ninety two and for thirteenth question the answer is insertion sort does not respect fixed points but selection sort does. And coming to the 14th question, the answer is odd. 15th question, the option is 4. And coming to the 16th question, minimizing the difference between the sum of these degrees of the vertices in A and B. So here you can check answers and submit. So if you give the wrong answers also, you can check these answers and you can uh, write the correct answers. So this is regarding the assignment zero and you can check answers and submit so that the answers are submitted this is regarding the multiple choice and this is uh, for assignment zero we are having this programming assignment problem one which uh, will go to the programming assignment problem one so this is regarding the multiple questions and uh, we'll see the uh, programming assignment problems one by one 